Monday, Principal Financial Group announced its purchase of Wells Fargo Institutional Retirement and Trust Business, becoming one of the largest companies in the industry. Principal says they paid $1.2 billion for $827 billion worth of Wells Fargo assets. That includes their 401k, pension, executive deferred compensation, employee stock ownership plans, and asset advice business. That's roughly 1.5 cents on the dollar. Be one of the top three in the industry, you know, is huge. Either get bigger or go home. David Harkin is a financial planner in Des Moines. He says the purchase couldn't have come at a better time. A friend of his who works at Principal told Harkin they were thinking about making cuts in preparation for the next recession. They need to either buy somebody or lay off people. And they are, from my understanding, about ready to lay off, you know, quite a few people. So people don't care. They just don't want their fees to go up. And they most likely won't at all. Harkin says Wells Fargo clients shouldn't be worried about the fees going up and they probably won't even notice the transition. If I was an advisor and I had Wells Fargo assets and I was moving over the principal, I, would be, I wouldn't be concerned at all. I would go about my business and I would assume that they're going to do their due diligence on their end. In Des Moines, Bo Bowman, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.